Hi, dear students. Uh, today we're going to talk about the uh, class uh, estimating and costing, CEQS 3220. Uh, in this class, I just wanted to highlight some, some points. I don't want to talk about the class itself because if you, wanted to, if you want to check on the class itself, you can go to the students portal and check the handouts and all the information about the class itself. But however, today I wanted to highlight that there's, uh, there will be some change in the class itself. Uh, from like 40 to 50 percent of the contents will be changed however all the curriculum itself it's, it will be the same the outcome and all the main topics of the of the class will be the same uh, but some of the changes in the contents will be like as i told you that from 40 to 50 percent uh, what are these changes uh, first of all the changes will be more realistic uh, problems that we will have in our in our class we will have more realistic uh, exercises we, uh, and also uh, issues that we will discuss in the class it will be more realistic and related to real life world. Uh, number two, the more exp uh, exercises that were added to the class in fact. So I have cancelled some of the simple exercises and I have added some more uh, some more or extra uh, exercises for the class itself. The third thing is that the problems itself be became more complicated so it needs more, so, uh, more thinking and uh, the, uh, the, the simple, uh, class, uh, simple exercises sorry, were uh, removed from the content of, the, of this class. Uh, number four, real world work experience were added to this class also. As I told you that we will have some, some issues, we will discuss some issues and examples from the, uh, from the experience itself. Topics also were added to the, to the, to the class and uh, these topics, in fact, they are uh, already in the, in the main topic of the class, uh, of the handout itself, of the class itself, but I have expanded the information in some of the uh, topics that I fe felt it will be more uh, enrichment for the experience of the students. Uh, number six, for this reason, I have established a YouTube channel. Uh, it is called Project Management Simplified. Uh, this channel is uh, intended to help the students to uh, study uh, to study more problem solving and if you want to have like extra problem solving all these things you will find it in this uh, channel. Uh, the videos uh, from site you will have some more information and experience from site you will find some videos I have uploaded these videos uh, in this uh, channel. So problem solving and uh, also videos from site experience you'll get some more some more information from the site in this uh, youtube channel the project management simplified you are required to uh, subscribe and also you need to click on the bell icon to get the every time we we add like uh, problem solving and uh, some some issues related to the class itself you will be uh, notified so according to these changes what you uh, what is required from you First of all, uh, it's a better planning for the course selection. So if, if the students want to select like five classes in this semester, which is semester number two, uh, academic year 2019-20, uh, you need to like a better plan, better time, do, do, do the math for the time management because uh, this class is not like before. Maybe you have heard from some of the students that this, this class is easy and simple and it doesn't need that much time for, for study. Now it will be like, it needs more like uh, time for studying. So I don't want you to like uh, overload yourself, study, uh, to choose like five classes, then afterwards at the end, uh, at the, uh, sorry, for at the, after mid, uh, midterm exam, you, you are urged to uh, drop so, some of the classes or at least one class, so no need for that. Just like plan well, do the math, uh, do your time management. In order to, to uh, in order not to drop some of the some of the classes that you have already choose, uh, the other thing is that that this, as I told you, that this class uh, now it will need more time for studying, and also there is a more logic, practical, and arithmetical thinking is required in this uh, in this class, especially in the exercises itself. All the classes, all the information I'm, I'm providing in this class now are uh, almost uh, real numbers, real uh, prices, real costs, and also the, the ex exam, uh, exam uh, exercises, problems, and even in the handout itself are real uh, exercises. Uh, we will have like assignments, and 
at least one of these assignments it will be an in-class assignment. It's very important that we will have a one in-class assignment. Each student will do the, the assignment himself in the, in, the stu in, the, in the class itself. I will try hardly to get one site visit or uh, visit to the, to the fair if there is any fair. During this semester, I'll try hardly to uh, have a one site visit with you to explain the, the, the building materials, the building construction processes. Otherwise, you will find all these things uh, available in the YouTube uh, channel. So these things I wanted to highlight in this in this video. I just wanted to ch to check on this uh, uh, before you choose the, the the class of this semester. J just to be ready for that. Just to be ready for choosing or or to determine which which classes you need to choose in this semester. Thank you very much and good luck. Your teacher Omar Ali Al Abdul Wahid.